I love my country. I'm not going to apologize for it. Period. And they think we're nothing but puppets for them. We're not. We're Americans born of a revolution. I just wish college was that. I wish college was actually about creating more mature, better prepared, stronger people for the world. And it's all about putting the American people and America first. I've been involved with the Jewish Republican Alliance because having a community that understands the issues is so important. Having an organization that understands the existential threats that are faced by Jews, by Israel, and frankly, by America and Western civilization as a whole is fundamental. And being able to be part of that community is so heartening. It gives us all a feeling of inspiration, of fellowship. And the group, as I've discovered, really values knowledge. It values contemplative thought. It values um, the fellowship of feeling, of recognizing everything that's important. And it's been a delight to be part of. And they think we're nothing but puppets for them. We're not. We're Americans born of a revolution. DNA, a revolution is in our veins. And they can't take my gun from me, and they can't take it from you. And, and Joe Biden has been in government for almost 47 years. That's almost half a century. Half a century. He haven't done anything, not one thing, for black America that was good. We cannot afford to let those those folks do what they did to my community through our country. And we, we now understand, we're, we're waking up. And it's because we know that they're not gonna win this for sure. I love my country, I'm not gonna apologize for it. Period. We've got so many people that are so brilliant in what they do in their day-to-day -day lives. You add in conservatism in that and the discussion of conservative values, it, it, it's, it's mind-boggling it, mind that this hasn't existed before, but it, it will blow your mind if you do join. The importance of the Jewish Republican Alliance because it's grassroots. There are others out there and I respect them and I'm friends of them, but they're top down. They come from Washington, D.C. and they do very important work, but it's, it's at that level. Whereas this group is, is grassroots and I think that's the reason for its success is it just started out as a handful of people telling a handful of people telling a handful of people. And because of that, it's in the community, it's people you know, it's people that you can not only relate to, but you can turn to. There are things that we can do outside of this organization because we've met each other inside this organization. When Trump came in, the world changed. Uh, every, all of the old time, this is why there are a bunch of uh, national security professionals who are never Trumpers because uh, he repudiated their lifetime of work. Hard American people are waking up to the fact of what is happening and they are now warriors. We have more warriors in America, people who understand the truth, than I think ever before. I think that Socratic discourse and dialogue and different ideas is very important. I just wish college was that. I wish college was actually about creating more mature, better prepared, stronger people for the world. I feel like everybody is very real. Um, it's an environment where I can feel safe and talk about things that maybe I can't with other people. It feels like a community, a family. Um, everyone's very kind and loving and I really enjoy it. We started out with 18 people in the back room of an Agora Hills restaurant. And now, the Jewish Republican Alliance is filled one of the largest temples west of the Mississippi with the leading conservative thinker in America, Dennis Prager. All right, let me tell you something. Here's my view on the Jewish Republican Alliance and on the, the places that do good work. I say it on the show every day. There, there are two types of people who do good. The ones who do the good and the ones who help the ones who do the good. Not everybody's a fighter, but everybody can help the fighters. These guys are fighters. So if it means joining them, if it means sending them money, We are the party of Abraham Lincoln, the party of the Emancipation Proclamation that freed the slaves while Democrats tried to stop it, the party that largely passed the 1964 and 1965 Civil Rights Act that Democrats largely opposed. We are the party of Jackie Robinson, 
the first black Major League Baseball player. We are the party of freedom and liberty and lower taxes. The party that puts America first and the party that supports free and fair elections and opposes unsolicited mail-in ballots and ballot harvesting. Every day that you walk this earth, you are writing the story of your own life. So I have a few questions for you. Are you writing yourself as the hero of your own story? Do you have the courage to pick up that pen? And who would you like to be a hero to? Would you like to be a hero to your spouse, your parents, your children, your siblings, your friends, your congregation? Because now more than ever, your patriotic conservative activism is needed to defend the Judeo-Christian values upon which our beloved country was founded. This is your time to continue to write the story of your life with you as the hero to help create the future you and your family so richly deserve. May you all be blessed with the wisdom of choosing good friends and the ambition to create community. Bruce and Mitch are incredible leaders. They're not just founders of an organization, they're actually hands-on. They come to every group meeting, every event. They make sure that people know about who's coming in. They make sure to be active in the community. And that's really important, especially in a city like Los Angeles, which can feel lonely and far away. Mitch and Bruce, they're only a phone call away. They answer my questions. They let me know who's gonna come. They let me bring guests. The tickets are always you know, affordable and incredible, and there's opportunities to even meet the speakers, which I really like. They make it feel like a family. It's always a love fest when I come out to an event, and that's because of the founders. So if you haven't joined, what are you waiting for? Come check out the speakers. Come to one of the VIP events. This is the place for you, for everyone.